Hello guys, welcome back to RJ Tech. So as in this video, I'm going to show you how to solve this error in the Photoshop. I recently opened my Photoshop and uh, faced this error and find the solution of this problem. And I think uh, to share this solution with you. So I have found out two solutions of this problem. Uh, one is to block internet connection uh, of the Photoshop by using firewall protections or other. But there is a disadvantage of this first method. If you block internet connection of the Adobe Photoshop, then will you can't uh, see the live preview of tools like this, and you can't uh, see the help section of the Windows, and you can't uh, get any help of uh, Windows. So if you don't uh, want to do that, then you can simply choose the second method in which you can buy the subscription plan by visiting the adobe creative cloud website i will provide the link in the dis in description also you can subscribe the premium version to remove this error so well without wasting time let's get started so first of all uh, you can see i'm open adobe photoshop and seeing this error this app has been disabled now if you want to close the photoshop it will be not closed and even if you right click on the icon and then click on the close window then it will not work how to do that so simply right click on the taskbar and open the task manager now at here you can see adobe photoshop simply click on it and click on end task now you can see your uh, photoshop is now closed now to block a uh, firewall simply click on the start icon at here and open settings now add up update and security and at here uh, simply search a uh, firewall simply click on the first one and now a window open in the bottom you can see advanced setting click on this once you done you will see a uh, another window now click on the inbound rules in the left side and simply click on the new rule on the right side of and uh, leave it default program click on next and here you want to browse the path of your adobe photoshop and if you see in this side in other application then you can browse the path of this application and for the path of uh, Adobe Photoshop, simply click on the start icon and search here Adobe Photoshop again. Now expand this and at here simply click on open file location. Now again right click on it and click on open file location. Now right click on this Photoshop uh, icon and click on properties. Now in the location section you will see the path. Simply copy it. Open the firewall window click on browse and paste the path at here once you done click and press enter and you will see uh, photoshop.exe file simply click on this and click on open now simply click on next and uh, if you want to block the connection then simply click on the third one and click on next now leave them default uh, checked if uh, one of them is unchecked simply check this and click on next now at here simple type any name like I type Adobe Photoshop. Now click on finish and you will see a rule is defined in the inbound rules. Now simple click on the outbound rules and again click on new rules at the left right side and now simple leave the default program and at here browse the path again and again select the photoshop.exe file and click on open now click on next simple click on block the connection next check them all click on next and right here simple write a name keep in mind uh, this name is different from the older one so i type uh, photoshop now click on finish once you done you will see there is a rules photoshop in the outbound rules and you can also see adobe photoshop rule in the inbound rules now close all the windows and try to open the adobe photoshop again now this time you can see our adobe photoshop is opened without any error we can also create a new file 
and uh, we can also create shapes uh, custom shapes uh, and all are done with the smooth without any error so i hope uh, you will like the video and one disadvantage is that you can't uh, see the preview of uh, any tools if you want to see the preview of uh, all the tools you can simply use the paid subscription version from the adobe creative clouds and that's it if you found this video helpful click on the like button and uh, if you like uh, tips and tricks like this uh, simply click on the subscribe button and turn on the bell icon for the future videos thanks for watching we will meet in the next one see you have a good day